Controversial activist and public figure Dr. Umar Johnson recently made startling claims regarding the tragic deaths of music icons Michael Jackson and Whitney Houston. In a YouTube video that has since gone viral, Dr. Umar suggested a connection between the two deaths, alleging that both artists were targeted and ultimately silenced by their record labels. According to Dr. Umar, both Jackson and Houston were no longer of value to their respective music companies. Jackson, who famously owned half of the Beatles' catalog, was planning to leave his label and take control of his music. Similarly, Houston was allegedly seeking more control over her master's and publishing rights. Dr. Umar contends that these actions threaten the financial interests of their labels, leading to their untimely demises. Dr. Umar also pointed fingers at industry figures, including Clive Davis, suggesting their involvement in the alleged conspiracies. He claimed that Davis, a renowned music producer and executive, may have had a role in Houston's death, allowing a Grammy party to continue at the Beverly Hilton Hotel while Houston's body remained in her room. The activist's claims have sparked renewed interest in the circumstances surrounding Jackson and Houston's deaths, which have long been shrouded in mystery and speculation. Many fans and observers have questioned the official narratives, citing inconsistencies and unanswered questions. It's important to note that these are just allegations made by Dr. Umar and have not been substantiated. However, they have reignited discussions about the power dynamics within the music industry and the lengths to which some may go to protect their interests. The music world lost two of its brightest stars in Michael Jackson and Whitney Houston, and their legacies continue to be marred by controversy and unanswered questions. Dr. Umar's claims, while controversial, highlight the complexities of fame, power, and control in the entertainment industry.